in the minus 100 kilograms Olympic preview, we're going to have a look at a category that is absolutely wide open. For me, the favourite, probably Hager of Japan, he is the current world champion. But thrown in the mix, Gaviniashvili of Georgia is one of the most exciting fighters on show at the moment. He has qualified as an outside qualification and he's going to be thrown into the mix there and he could end up with anybody. He's going to be chasing the Uranagi, that's for sure. He's got the most amazing Uranagi that he chases all the time. Let's have a little look at one of his Uranagis that he did in a tournament previously and a huge Ippon. The Georgians have their own special way of gripping up. Gaviniashvili in the Baku Grand Slam final against Sienic, he was looking for his own particular grip and he has a cross grip that he starts with. And what he does, he pulls the arm across and he goes right the way around the back of his opponent here so that he can get his big hip throws in and to go all the way across with the hips for his uh, Ogoshi. But what happens is he sometimes then takes the other one underneath as well. So he's got one over the top, one underneath here. When he takes the belt, that's when he starts to come across for the left Ogoshi, which is really dangerous. Sienic, he felt it, of course. And what happened was then he was looking to get all the way around the back and he chases him down. He chases him and he gets his legs right the way underneath here until in the end here he catches him with the uranagi. The whole point is, is that he chases the grips. He knows what he wants. He chases the cross grip, arm goes around the back for the hip throws. He goes underneath with the other arm. He wants the close contact for the hip throw the other side and then he gets right the way around the back and he picks him up for the biggest Uranagi you've ever seen. Absolute brilliance from Gavinias Billy and he must have a chance of a good medal at the Olympics.